Here's the otter. I've now disconnected the tail from the flippers. We're now moving into the final stages of the swimming sea otter out of Walrus Ivory. Now I'm going to move on to putting the nose, the ear holes, and the eyes. And then I'm going to add in the, uh, the flipper lines and the finger lines. I've already prepared my baleen to be inlaid, just kind of sharpened to a point. And the way I do it when I do otters is that I put the glue on. Do the eyes first. Snip them out. So there's both the eyes, and then I'll take the one of the one I just used for the eyes. That's why I kind of put the glue up a little further, so I don't have to. With baleen, it's a lot softer than ivory, so you can kind of uh, force it into place. And then I always cut the nose out a little bit farther because I want the nose to be kind of sticking out of the ivory. So there's the eyes and the nose, inlaid baleen. Now I'm gonna, now I'm gonna put the uh, flippers and the fingers. Flipper like lines, his fingers, it's and not he's focused. got. Huh? It's not focused. Huh? Needs to focus. Yeah. And that hole I drilled right there, that's going to be the baleen stem to the base. So there's the otter, all shaped out, all carved out. 
And now all we have left to do now is polish him and then add the fur and the base stick. All right.